Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Roll Easy here, and I'm back with a dope modded outfits tutorial. Uh, you know, I've been wondering what to post on the channel because these money glitches, they're great, don't get me wrong, I love them, but yeah, you know, we've been posting a lot of them, so I wanted to make something different, change the norm. Every other YouTuber is just posting money glitches and gift cards to friends, so I wanted to be a bit different. I ran a poll on Twitter, which I'll put up on the screen soon. And I asked you guys what you wanted to see. I put options like outfit glitches, you know, uh, wall breaches and launches, which I still want to do because I have so much fun doing those. But here's the poll right here. And uh, I asked you guys, and the majority of you said outfit glitches, okay? A few other people said some modded cars, uh, you know, some upgrades, uh, crew colors, things like that. I will probably get to those, but these were the final results. I ran this poll for three days, and this is the result that we got, okay? So. Uh, you know, I want to show you guys that I do listen to you and I'm gonna be posting two modded outfits right here Two dope modded outfits. You're looking at one right now If you want to take part in these polls go ahead and follow me on Twitter. The link is down in the description, okay? But uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get started here real soon And I'm gonna show you guys how to make both of these outfits So first thing you want to go ahead and do is we're gonna be making that orange outfit We need the orange jogger. So go to style Go to racing outfits and go over to none okay if you're already on none then go away from none and then go back to none okay so now back out of the menu now you want to go ahead and start up with this this adversary mode okay it's called occupy all right now in this adversary mode you're going to need one friend to do this so link up down in the comment section down here and find people on your console throw your gamer tags and find one friend Go ahead and launch it. You can get purple or orange joggers, and it comes with CEO armor. That's what I wanted to show you guys. So if you want, you can save this to another outfit too and keep the CEO armor. Totally up to you. So once you spawn into the job, all you want to do is go ahead and go to style, and you see how the racing outfit isn't grayed out? Move it once to the right, and now it's grayed out. Now stay on the interaction menu. Xbox, we got to open up our dashboard and just wait to lag out. Okay, don't touch your controller. PlayStation, you guys have it a lot easier. Just go ahead and open up Spotify, suspend application. It'll give you a warning. Just suspend the app, go back to GTA, and you'll get kicked into a new session. Uh, Xbox, we're going to get this alert. We've been kicked from the session for idling too long. That's exactly what we want. All right, so now both of us, if you suspended or if you waited, doesn't matter, we will spawn in with the outfit. Now, go ahead and save this outfit. The only thing I could say is if you haven't unlocked the Tron stuff, like the Tron outfits, take off the Tron helmet before you save it, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and save the outfit right here to my first slot. I'm going to name it Orange Fit. So here we go. I'll save it a couple times just in case. Now that you have your orange joggers, we're going to go ahead and start making this outfit. All right. Hope you guys are ready. This is a really cool outfit. I spent a good amount of time coming up with both of these. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy them. So go ahead and make your way into the clothing store and go straight to the shoes section. All right. Once we're at the shoes section, you're going to want to go ahead and put on the go to the sneakers put on the bla black plain high tops all right black plain high tops you want to throw these on now you want to go over to the top section we're going to be you know screwing with the vests all right this is a really cool vest glitch all right so what you want to go ahead and do is go over to the vest and we're going to need to buy one of these right here but you see how they're grayed out they're grayed out because you actually need to go ahead and put a vest on all right those vest shirts uh, need a vest so just throw on like this vest right here now go to vest shirts and you see now you can actually buy these we're gonna be buying the lemon band vest shirt all right so go ahead and buy that one now go back to vest and once you're on vest you're gonna put on this one the quarterback navy sweater vest all right we need that one all right quarterback navy sweater vest I know it doesn't match don't worry it's all part of the glitch you'll see it all come together later okay so once you've gotten that quarterback navy sweater vest, go ahead and go to the accessory section and you want to go to gloves. Put on these black leather gloves, all right? So once you got the black leather gloves on, you want to go ahead and save this as an outfit, just like this, okay? The gloves are going to come off later, but you put them right back on when we're in the apartment, all right? So once we have saved this as an outfit, you want to make your way over to your apartment, all right? Simple as that. So go ahead and after this, Make your way over to your apartment. I think I was going over here just to check to make sure I had everything. Oh yeah, you need one more thing before you go to your apartment. I almost forgot. You need to go to Heist Coveralls, and you need to buy one of these with the gas mask, okay? There's four options there. I have the quarantine, but any one of those with the gas mask will work, okay? So, once you've purchased one of those, now you can go ahead and head over to your apartment. You just need one of those purchased, all right, to be able to pick it. Now, we're gonna go to our apartment, and I'm just walking in right here over at Del Perro. I'm gonna go down to the clothing uh, closet, I guess. And uh, yeah, go ahead and equip 
that heist coverall that we were talking about, all right? So remember, you want the one with the gas mask. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to the heist coveralls. I'm gonna put the quarantine outfit on. This is the one with the gas mask. Any one of those four will do. Run back upstairs or whenever, wherever your telescope is in your apartment. We're gonna do the telescope glitch. So run by the telescope, smash around on the D-pad, pull away from the stick, uh, or pull away with the left stick and open up your interaction menu. If done correctly, the mask will come off. Go to style, select the orange outfit that we're working on, close the interaction menu and walk away. Boom, see that? We got the gas mask on. That's what you wanna see. So go back down to your closet and save this as an outfit. All right, now this is what I recommend after you save it. Open up your interaction menu again, Hover over this outfit and just spam A or X on it a few times, okay? Just spam it like five times or so. This does help with this next part. So press pause, go to jobs, go to play jobs, Rockstar created missions, and start up a Titan of a job, all right? Once you've started up a Titan of a job, just go ahead and launch it completely. Hopefully you will spawn like this with no arms with the gas mask on. There's another result that you can get, okay? If you spawn in with, uh, with arms and you have a black bag on your head, then just go ahead and quit out of the job, equip this outfit again with the gas mask and start up Titan of a job again. Okay, once you've done that, you will spawn in just like this with invisible arms. You must have invisible arms in Titan of a job and the gas mask for this to work properly, okay? So, go to your closet. Now what you wanna go ahead and do is we're gonna go to those vests that we just bought or that vest shirt. And you see, it's all gonna glitch off there, but watch this, click on lemon band vest shirt a and boom there you go now you have a super glitched uh vest outfit looks really really cool go ahead and go to your accessories and throw on those gloves again the black leather gloves because they actually glitched off when we did this and there you go so we have a big portion of the outfit done just like that save it from inside a titan of a job all right i like to save everything a couple times just to make sure it all sticks open up your phone and go ahead and quit out of titan of a job all right so head over to the mass shop once you're out of titan and you're back in a session and once you're at the mask shop, go ahead and hit right D-pad, and we're gonna be going over and picking this really cool gas mask, okay? So, go over to gas, and it's number three, the Viper Respirator. You wanna put on the Viper Respirator mask. Now you wanna save this as an outfit, all right? So save this as an outfit, then go right next to uh, the, masks, the masks and pick a hat, all right? The hat that we're gonna be using, it's actually a combat helmet. So go down, to, or, or up I should say, it's a lot quicker to combat helmets, and it's number 39 on the list. It's the Tiger Dual Lens, all right? There's actually a quad lens for the Tiger. If you think that looks better, you can go ahead and pick that one. I thought the Dual Lens looked a little bit better. It wasn't as bulky, okay? So there we go. We got the Tiger Dual Lens, just go ahead and buy that. You're gonna see it's actually gonna equip. So open up your interaction menu, go to style, and actually just select your outfit. Now we're wearing the mask with the rest of the outfit. This is what you wanna see. So at this point, head over to this area on the beach where we have some telescopes, and we're gonna be doing the telescope glitch right over here. So remember, just go ahead and sprint over towards the telescope, smash around on the D-pad and pull away with the left stick. Done correctly, everything will come off. Go to style, now go to accessories. Now, we're going to be going over to helmets, go over to the Tiger, Dual, or Quad Lens, whichever one you're using, and go ahead and close your interaction menu and walk away. Once you've done that, boom. We have both of them glitched on. We have our headgear. This outfit is coming together pretty, pretty closely right now. We're almost there. Go ahead and save the outfit once again, all right? Once we've saved the outfit, we're going to do one more really cool glitch to really put this outfit and make it come together. So go to this clothing store right here. The reason we're going to this clothing store is because it's right next to the strip club. All right. The strip club is literally right there. The clothing store is right there. Nice and easy to get to. So go over to the outfit section and you want to put on one of these flight suits. All right. Any one of them with a black uh, hose on it. You see that black flight suit hose right there? That's what we're going to be glitching off and putting onto our outfit. So ride a bike or run over to the strip club. Once you've done that, simply walk in there and you're gonna notice, look at the flight suit hose. See the hose, it's like gone. That's because it's all glitched out. So open up your style, go to the outfit, select the outfit we're working on and close your interaction menu and just walk out of the strip club. Once you've walked out, you're gonna see that the flight hose is glitched on successfully. Now go ahead and run back or take a bike over to the clothing store press right on the d-pad and you want to save this about three or four times it doesn't always stick so that's why i want to save it a few times once you do that it's guaranteed to stick okay now go ahead and open up your, your interaction menu again go to the parachutes put on that black parachute bag and now save this as an outfit and there you go guys we have a super dope orange modded outfit super glitched out we got a glitchy vest shirt on it you notice you know the black parts and everything they move around while you walk 
That's why I love these vest shirt glitches right here. You got the flight suit, you know, you got hat, uh, hat and mask and all that gear. It's really, really cool, guys. You can put the visor up or down, whichever one suits you better. But yeah, man, super dope outfit. So we're going to get on to this next one. For this next outfit, you do need the black joggers. So remember, to get the black joggers, just like the other ones, you want to go to racing outfits and set it to none. And you're actually going to be starting up a Titan of it, or not Titan, sorry. You're going to be going to the adversary modes, and this is the job you want to start out. Vehicle Vendetta. You need a friend for this as well. Link up down in the comments and do the glitch the same way I showed you in the beginning. So once you have the black joggers saved, go ahead and go to the sneakers, and we're going to be picking these white plain high tops, all right? Uh, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but the sneakers are my favorites for joggers. They look great. So once you've gotten the white plain high tops, go over to the top section. At the top section, we're going to be putting on one of these overcoats. Okay, so go to overcoats, and it's actually number 61 on the list. It's called the Lime Open Parka. All right, this is like a neon outfit. It's really, really cool. It's probably my new favorite outfit that I've ever made. All right, so the lime open parka right here all right it like glows at night too kind of you know it's not meant to but it kind of does glow so once you've done that go to t-shirts and we're going to be picking that bear t-shirt it's number 35 on the list so i'm going to go ahead and scroll down there as quickly as possible i don't want to make this tutorial way too long for you guys but there you go the bear t-shirt select that bear t-shirt now we're going to be going over to the accessories now I put on this chain right here. It's totally up to you. You can put on whatever chain you want, but I felt like a chain would definitely, you know, look good with this neon outfit, something bright and vibrant. So we're going to go down to number 18 on the list and put on the platinum diamond curb chain. All right, this, this one right there. So once you've done that, go over to the glove section and put on the white cotton gloves. All right, you're going to see them right here. There you go. The white cotton gloves. All right. So now this outfit's starting to come together. It's not as long as the other one. Uh, you know, this one's nice and simple to make. No crazy glitches on this one. Just a really cool outfit. You want to save this now as an outfit. See that? I'm naming it Neon Fit. So this is the outfit that we're working on. I'm going to go ahead and save it a few times just to make sure. Before you leave the clothing store, make sure you go ahead and buy these. They're under the sports glasses. They're called the Green Urban Ski. All right. These are like the ski goggles. You want to just buy those and uh, go ahead and just select your outfit again so that it actually, um, you know, it actually just kind of it, you, you're, we're not saving it with the goggles yet we're going to be doing a glitch to get that all on together at the same time so once you've done that you got this outfit almost fully made up go ahead and go to the mask shop once again over at Vespucci Beach go into the mask section and we're going to be going over to the cultural mask once you're there go down to number 19 on the list it's called the furious luminous I believe all right let's get to it right here uh yeah furious luminous all right there we go so you see that it kind of matches it's super neon i really like this mask it's cool there's a few other ones that look similar to it go ahead and make your pick this is like a base outfit guys that you guys can do a lot with so save this as an outfit with the mask on it go over to the hat section and we're going to be putting on this uh it's another combat helmet it's called the green stars combat helmet all right should be number 47 on the list so let's get there as quickly as possible 47 there we go the green stars combat helmet Go ahead and equip that. Well, to equip, to buy it, you have to equip it. So just like before, go over to the outfit we're making and just select it so that you have the mask saved and everything. So go over to that same spot, do the telescope glitch. Once you've done the telescope glitch, open up the interaction menu just like that. Go over to style, and we're going to be going over to the accessories. All right? So go to the accessories, and now go over to the hats, well, or helmets, I should say, and we're going to be putting on that green stars helmet, all right, and that combat helmet. Now go to glasses, and we're going to be going over to those ski goggles, the green urban ski goggles. There we go. So back out of the interaction menu, walk away, and you're going to see everything glitch on all together. Boom. There we go, guys. Looking pretty sick. All right. Instead of our eye shown, we got those cool lens right there. Now go ahead and go back to the mask shop, throw on a black parachute bag, and save this as an outfit. All right. And there we go, guys. I tried to make this tutorial not, you know, crazy long. Ended up being a little longer than I wanted, but I wanted to make sure you guys understood everything and how these glitches worked. I love outfits. I know you guys do too. Nobody's making modded outfits right now, so I thought I would be just a bit different from everyone else. And it's what you guys asked for. You know what? And I listen to you guys, all right? So just showcasing both of the outfits right now. If you guys have any more requests, any other kind of videos you guys want to see from me on the channel, let me know down in the comment section. If you enjoyed this one and you want to see more modded outfits, let me know in the comment section, all right? I'm always down to make these. These are really cool. They take a little while, but I don't mind for you guys. So, 
yeah, that's gonna be it. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and learned something about these uh, these modded outfits and all these outfit glitches. My name is Roll Easy. Make sure if you're brand new to the channel to hit that big red subscribe button, turn on post notifications, and drop a fat like on this video for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 25,000 subscribers. Peace out, everybody, and have a great day.